Okay, so this side is open and I'll, I'll put one of these things to hold it in place. Okay, this is open completely, so actually I don't need to. So it's open here. Open here, you see these tabs, it keeps it in place. And now the whole thing actually, it's ready. Now you have the battery. First you have to disconnect the battery so you can separate the back from the front. And that's the connector, it's out. And the whole battery. This is a simple battery, you can replace this. So that's the battery, it's easy to replace this if needed. And there is not much from the back. Now this is the important part. These are the boards for the keys. All this is, they are mechanical keys, it's a mechanical keyboard. Information, Blackmagic Design, Copyright Information 2020. And also there is a separate board for these ones, for the source and timeline. There, there's a separate board. Try not to touch with your hands the electronics on this, or if you do have to touch, touch some metal surface first. What we really care about here is this part, this is where I'm going to replace the bearings. That's the actual magnetic encoder. And you can see how it's moving. You see how it's moving. And it's not, it's not the, I thought before that it's some of the screws that are loose, but it's not the screws, it's the actual encoder itself. So first to open this, first I have to, I will disconnect it. This is a bit of a difficult. I'll use an opener tool to put some tension on the edges. Not sure if that did anything, but now pulling it, I should be able to wiggle it a bit or pull it, ideally I should grab it from the edges like that. But my nails are really not so great now. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to pull on the cables and hope no cable breaks. Yeah, better use this tool. Okay, it moved a bit. I think it's ready, ready to come out. Okay, the connector is out. Cables themselves look okay. Hopefully, can't return till I use it. And now that this is disconnected, we go to the other side and undo these screws. I want to check the size. Okay, this one fits. I removed it before, so it's not the first time to remove it. These are some very tiny screws, like that. Very small. And before I got a bit confused with the, with the arrangement, I was trying to put other screws here, so be careful that you really arrange the screws. Here they don't matter because they're all the same, but try not to put other screws here. Um, this is the magnetic encoder coming out. It's really simple, but perfect. I don't need something complicated. And the case is ABS for this plastic. Okay, I'll put this aside. Now this is really important for me because I like to use the wheel. I like to use the wheel on this thing and I can't really use it much when it's shaking like that.